everybody, welcome back to the channel. Today I have another quick walk around video. Today it is on this 2022 Kia Sorento plug-in hybrid, and this is the SX Prestige trim level. It also has all-wheel drive, as all the plug-ins do. So let's get this video started right now. If you could, before I get started on this video, please like this video and subscribe to my channel, and let's get this video started right now. All right, so starting off with the front here, standard Kia uh, Sorento design, which is absolutely stunning and aggressive. Uh, they didn't really do much to the front end design here on the Sorento uh, plug-in hybrid. They kept it the more traditional uh, Sorento look, very aggressive, um, very good looking. You do have LED headlights here with the LED daytime running light there, LED fog lights on the bottom, and then you have uh, some parking sensors here on the front that allow you to uh, to know when you're getting close to something on the front of the vehicle little black accents on the bottom there coming on over to the driver's side here is the standard wheel um, on all of the plug-in hybrids uh, for 2022 uh, gray finish on the interior and silver finish on the out silver uh, spoke here on the door handle or the door leading over to the door mirror cap there that's body colored here with the snow white pearl glacier white pearl that's on it you'll see down here on the bottom you do have a little camera there on the bottom of the mirror because this does have surround view monitoring coming on to the back you do have led taillights here on the back nice aggressive black little uh, shark fin spoke there on the back of it led taillights here these are used for your turn signals in your brakes uh, and then down here on the bottom, you'll see that right there, it kind of blends in, uh, but right there is your reverse light. You'll see all-wheel drive spelled out here on the back and Sorento spelled out all the way out here on the side. You also see that it uh, has the Eco plug-in badge here. New Kia logo on the back. And that's the rear design. Let's open up this cargo area. All right, so coming to the back of the Sorento, real quick what I'm gonna do is you'll see that there's a little sticker here saying to put your hand right here, underneath there. I'm gonna turn the, or press the button there, and it's gonna pop open, power lift gate here on this SX Prestige. And then on the interior here, you have tons of cargo space in the back here of the Sorento. Now, if you do have the uh, one of the third row seats up here, there are two seats underneath of this cargo mat, which I'll pull back. Now, this is all in plastic because it just came out off the truck. Uh, the only way really you can see any vehicles these days right off the truck, uh, but you can pull a seat up here and uh, you do have third row seating back here. Um, that cargo mat, once it's all situated and everything, um, it would um, lay up against it. Um, if you do have only one seat up though, this cargo mat would have to come out um, because you really couldn't use the cargo mat with these seats up there. Um, so, but with one seat up, um, you still have a ton of cargo space right there next to the seat and then also down here uh, as well. And uh, to put it down, it's just a simple pull on the strap, push it down, and then flip the mat back over. So pretty simple there. You also see that you have your charge port here, um, right here on the vehicle, because you're gonna plug this in at your house and uh, get some all electric range. 32 miles is the all electric range, uh, the maximum there. And then this side is um, where the plug port is. So on the other side, there's another cap that looks like for your gas. And then on this side, you have the um, charging port that you can plug right in there and uh, you can do that. So it's uh, laying out red or orange right now saying because the vehicle is on. <laughs> uh, but yeah, you can, uh, you can charge right there and get the estimated 32 miles of uh, all electric range here on this vehicle. And then uh, there is a little section underneath here that keeps all of your roadside assistance stuff. So your tire jack and everything like that there. And then of course some of the battery housing for the power and uh, electric compatibility there. Let's go up to that uh, underneath the engine hood real quick. All right, so underneath of the hood, you'll see right here that you have a 1.6 liter four cylinder engine that is turbocharged. Um, and it, then it is also hooked up to the um, plug-in hybrid uh, system there. Uh, and this system produces 261 horsepower combined. Um, you'll see some orange uh, wiring here. Those are uh, highlighted orange because um, those are the wires that you do not want to touch. They're high voltage wires. 
um, and they could seriously injure you. So Kia highlights them orange so that you do not touch them. Um, for maintenance here, you do have uh, your windshield wiper fluid there. You have your engine oil dipstick like traditional right there. Um, and then you have uh, some of the other reservoirs right over there. For maintenance on this vehicle, I would suggest going to your local Kia dealership to get it maintenance. Let's go uh, to the second row. Alrighty, so window sticker time. So, uh, you'll see here it is a 2022 Sorento Plug-in Hybrid SX Prestige all-wheel drive. Um, you have some fuel economy ratings over here. Um, you'll see that uh, if you get gas on, or gasoline only, you get 34 miles of combined um, city highway driving there. And then electricity plus gasoline um, combined 79 miles city and uh, highway there and an estimated 32 miles. Um, of all electric range. Um, you'll see down here the vehicle is produced, uh, final assembled in uh, Korea. And MSRP on this vehicle is $51,452. Let's pop open this back door. Now again, everything's wrapped up in plastic, uh, but this has got the gray interior here. Um, very nice door handles and door design right here. Black on the bottom, grayish on the top there. These seats are heated in the rear here as well. Two zone heated seats here, cup holder right there. And then you have captain's chairs here in the middle that uh, are very comfortable, very nice, and like I said before, heat it. Um, they also do have a little function up here. Um, there's a little button, and uh, you press the button there, and it will actually tilt the seat forward. And then actually, once it's uh, out of its plastic wrapping, um, it would slide forward um, to allow you access to that third row. Very nice. Uh, so I'll put that back there and uh, put it back in the seat. Um, and then I'll show you down here in the middle, you have two air vents down here, and then you have a fast charging USB port and a 12 volt um, outlet right down there as well that you can pop open. Um, again, this is like a blackish color, not white uh, with the plastic. And a pretty cool feature here on the Sorento, you do have USB chargers in the front driving seats. Um, you'll see them right there, pretty nice. Uh, to have that in the seats there. These also do have child uh, tether locks uh, on the bottom. And then above their head, they do have a panoramic sunroof that I can pop open and, uh, and show as well. Let's get up to the front row. All right, before I get up to the front row, I want to show you the key here. So a uh, Honda key that's come out uh, about a year or two years ago. Um, new Kia logo here. You have a remote start on the vehicle, lock, unlock, uh, power lift gate button there, and then your emergency hazard lights right there. Uh, very comfortable hand, key in your hand and uh, fits nicely in your pocket as well. Let's uh, come up to the front row. Doors are unlocked. I can pop it right open. And uh, you have this carried over gray interior. Nice softly padded. Nice armrest there. You also have your um, power windows, power locks uh, right there as well. You also do have memory seating here on the SX Prestige trim, two-way memory seating options. And then coming on over, you have some of your safety controls uh, right there. You also have the gas cap release that I will take you back here and show you. And you'll see it's at, uh, right there. You can lock that all up and it will lock with the vehicle. Punch that back in. Come on over here. You do have uh, also some lane departure warnings. You also have the button to hold um, for your uh, power lift gate and then some interior dimming lights. Over to the power seat, you have a nicely powered seat. It also has extending thigh cushions here. So you'll see that thigh cushion going in and out. Um, very nice. You also have lumbar support here and a regular power options. Very comfortable seating surfaces. And uh, you have a lot of technology in this vehicle. Uh, let's jump in and show you that. All right, so nice view here in the Kia Sorento plug-in hybrid SX Prestige. You also have this very big sunroof that stretches all the way back to the rear seats. Um, very nice, good visibility outside this vehicle. Um, you do have a standard 10.25 inch touchscreen here. Uh, dual zone automatic climate controls uh, right there that you can set. Coming on down a little further, you have a storage nook down there. And then on um, the shifter spot or the little grab handles here, you do have heated and ventilated seats. A little shifter down there and then also your controls for your all wheel drive system right there. And then if you come down a little bit further, you do have a heated steering wheel here in this option. You also have some of the brake hold and uh, parking brake options. And then you have two nicely, uh, very nice big cup holders and a little storage nook down there. And then you also have this nice uh, you know, armrest here for the 
um, comfort of the passenger in the front. And then you'll see the fully digital instrument cluster right there in the middle. Um, very nice instrument cluster right there. You do have that nice big uh, steering wheel that is heated here and it has uh, uh, all of your controls here. You have adaptive cruise control um, and uh, the volume controls as well here on this vehicle. Very nice, very comfortable vehicle. Let's uh, get this video wrapped up right now. Alrighty, so that's been a quick walk around video on this 2000. 22 Kia Sorento plug-in hybrid, a very nice car, uh, very fuel efficient, spacious, um, and it's going to um, give you lots of miles there on the highway. This vehicle is available, um, and it is up for sale here at Hertrick Honda Kia in Easton, Maryland. I uh, love to earn your business. If you could, though, uh, please like this video and subscribe to my channel. I'd love to keep you up to date on all the videos that I post. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.